if you have tips, suggestions, I'm new here. Help me, okay? Because <laughs> I watch YouTube videos just like y'all watching my videos, so help me, please. I don't wanna collab, no, unless I hit you up. Hey guys, what's up and welcome back. If you happen to be new, my name's Janesha. This is Adira and welcome to our channel. So today's video is going to be our first retie. I'm excited, but I'm not excited because this shit is hard. <laughs> so it has been a week and not a week i'm sorry i think it's like a month and 10 days or something like that since i completed the installation of my diy micro locks if you have not seen the full detailed installation video you don't have to pause this one but it might be helpful to go back check that out and then come back and watch this everybody says go back and watch that but i know i never stop what i'm doing and then go to, I, you understand where i'm coming from um by the way sir just climbed up on me so everybody say hey to sir Mwah. Okay, so anyway, um, it's been a month and some change since I finished installing my locks and it is already time to retie and this is going to be the first time, however, two weeks ago, I did go in and do the front. You probably can't tell now, but if you, com if you compare this to the back, which we'll see in a second, you will be able to tell that this is a little bit tighter. Um, again, I am new to this. I am not true to this. I have never maintained locks before, but I believe in myself. Um, I'm going to give you a quick look at how she's looking. That was an ugly sentence. But <laughs> a quick look at my hair. Just do a little 360 real quick. Um, so you guys can see what it's going to look like before in comparison to the after. So let me come on in here. Zoom in. Here's the ones that I've already kind of done here in the front. My like baby hairs, like this is supposed to be a lock and it refuses. It's like she refuses to stay. It's kind of the same thing on this side, but not as bad. So these are like my troubled ones, but we'll, we'll work on that. And give you a good look at all my dandruff and my roots. I think I probably. With these up here, I braided a little bit tighter to the root. Um, some of these down here, I did not. So you can clearly see that there's like more roots on these bottom ones, especially. For those of you that don't want to go back to the other video, I did braid my roots and twist the ends. And then on the sides right here, those are braided all the way down because my hair is more fine in those areas. But in order to maintain my locks, I will be interlocking from here moving forward until I decide otherwise, if I were to ever decide otherwise. This is actually a lot harder <laughs> than the install, um, just based off the few that I have done. So that's why I did the front two weeks ago and I didn't come back to it. <laughs> yeah, so let's get started with this process. Um, hopefully I get some good footage, but I'm gonna try not to make this video too long. If you have any questions, leave them down in the description. Nope, the description box is for me. The comments box is for you guys. So if you have questions, leave them down in the comment box. If you have tips, suggestions, I'm new here. Help me, okay? Because <laughs> I watch YouTube videos just like y'all watching my videos. So help me, please. <sighs> let's get set up. Let's get started. I just took a DNA test. Turns out I'm a hundred percent. That bitch, even when I'm crying crazy, yeah, I got boy problems. That's the human in me. Bling bling, then I solve them. That's the goddess in me. You put a little bad bitch, not the middle. If you what you call real, just a little. You best to hold me down, but you holding me back, and that's the sound. I mean, I'm calling you back. Why I'm in gray till they gotta be gray? Don't text me, tell it straight to my face. Best friend. Best friends set me down in the salon 
wheelchair. Shampoo, press, get you out of my hair. Fresh photos with the ball and lighting. New man on the Minnesota Vikings. True first niggas, of them always hiding. I'm long, 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 long. I'ma hit you back in a minute. I'll play that chopping it. We don't f with lies. All right, guys, so I'm going to do my very best to try to explain this in a way that makes sense, but I highly recommend looking through YouTube at how to interlock your roots and how to complete reties properly because, again, I am learning. But first things first, it is kind of a struggle <laughs> getting my hair through this tool from time to time and keeping it in there. I didn't realize until later that's because I was not sliding the lock all the way to the end where it gets skinny so that it can hold on to the lock. But once it's through the hole, you're going to be taking it through your roots. Um, another thing that I learned after my first few, don't just stick it through and pull it through. You need to make sure that you pull the tool all the way to the base of where the lock has stopped and the roots start before pulling it through. I had a few like kind of come undone or not be as secure be when I did not do that. So I learned it later on. Um, I am doing, I'm calling it a three point rotation, but I don't really know if that's what it is. So essentially I'm going from top to bottom, right to left, top to bottom, left to right. So I'm going up and down, then sideways, back up and down the other way sideways, up and down sideways. And I'm just repeating that until I get all the way to the root without pulling my hair from my scalp. <laughs> so I hope this is a good visual to show you what I did and how I did it. Again, this is my first retie. So once I get better and more comfortable, I'll come back and do a formal video, maybe explaining it a little bit better. Okay, I'm done. Finally. Oh, it's very tight. Um, I went back through some of these in the front because I did not really go all the way to the root. Um, but I have to be careful for it not to be too tight, which is very easy to do. Um, I have music playing in the background, so I'm going to hurry up. But basically, I'm going to wash my hair so I can clean my scalp and get these flakes out. And I am finally going to oil my scalp. After over a month, I get to oil my scalp. And I'm so excited about it. <laughs> So I shampooed my hair. Um, I used the Kenra clarifying shampoo because it's like the best clarifying shampoo that I have. Um, and it's still very much wet, but I'm finally gonna oil my scalp and I'm really excited about it. And I'm also TikToking. So I'm just gonna let you guys run and watch this while I make the TikTok. Oops, okay. I'm gonna use my hair, my turban because this won't cause lint. I don't think. Yeah, I'm just going to use this. <laughs> uh, this looks so funny. It's like... Eh. Mm. Oh. All right. Um, and FYI, you're going to hear me say this, but I am taking my Crown Care Collection Scalp Rescue and Peppermint, and I added rosemary oil to it. I don't sell it that way, unless y'all want it. I sell peppermint. I don't smell. I don't sell rosemary peppermint, um, but I added rosemary oil for myself. Um, I'm gonna try that out. If you guys are interested, I can start putting that on the site. Um, but just let me know what you think, Mayel. Watch out, girl. I'm coming for you. All right, friends. The retie is done. I washed my hair with a clarifying shampoo, and I just put this hair wrap on so that it can soak up some of the extra water. But I have waited months for this day where I can finally oil my scalp. <laughs> the flakes I've had enough of. And do you know how hard it is to own a small business where I make herbal infused hair growth oils and scalp oils and I can't use them? So I introduce to you. <laughs> Um, it's a crown care collection. You can look me up on Instagram or um, my website is naturallyadira.com and these are all like um, mostly organic and all natural hair growth oils that I make myself. But specifically, I have um, 
oils for your scalp that help with like dandruff and flakiness and itchiness and all of the things that I'm having issues with. So I'm finally going to use it. My tea's about to come out. I have waited months for this day where I can finally oil my scalp. And I added rosemary oil to it. We don't oh. we don't oh, do the vibes. We just keep it pushing like I I I